All right, and we should be live. Get this microphone right out of my face. What's up, guys? Oh, wait, why is this thing on this? Oh, there we go. That works. Let's see if that works. Let's unmute this. Oh, there we go. Ah! That works. All right, now I can hear myself. I know that I'm going out there. What's up, guys? What's happening? How's everyone doing tonight? It's Thursday night. The Steelers are playing. They're kind of winning. Kirby, what's happening? Fundy fan, oh eight. Prophet of Claws, Blade of Blazes. What's happening, guys? So you may notice the camera's a little different. X Sinister fifty one. What's happening, guys? If anyone was in Erie today, Erie, Pennsylvania. Dragon Claw Games was there. They were at Mill Creek Mall. They were at round one. <laughs> Gaming Master, what's up? Prophet Claus says, just got back from Bounce Magic with my son and hit two of the 2,500 ticket jackpots. Oh, my God. That's a lot of jackpots. Big cool guy, what's up? What's up? Guys, check this out. You're going to love this. Get a new. So I went to Best Buy, guys. I have two Best Buy gift cards now. I have one from back when, and I have the one I just won from that Keymaster uh, video that you guys just saw uh, last week. And, anyways, or was that this week? I don't remember. When did I put that one up? That was this week. Anyways, um, Wednesday? Wednesday? Yeah, it might have been yesterday. I don't know. Uh, anyways, so I have two Best Buy gift cards, and uh, I was going to go get another camera, but unfortunately Best Buy doesn't carry in store, apparently, the camera that I want to get as a secondary camera. So I just kind of moved this one down right now. It's a little hard to, I can't show you guys what I did, but it's sitting on a tripod, so we can take it, and we can move it, and we can point it. So you guys, we can still play the claws this way. How cool is that? So we can do that, and I gotta check my phone because it vibrated. But check that out, guys. We can play the claw and the coin pusher, and you guys may notice inside the coin pusher there. If you look really, really close at the back top le uh, level there, what do you guys see there? There's a little something there on that top level. You guys see that? A nice little uh, surprise there. So tilt this back up. Move the camera back here for now. Oops. There we go. So there we go. Oh, I forgot to erase the names from last time. Huh. Oopsies. Uh, Kirby, it is actually from Dave & Buster's. You said, is it the one, or is it the same as Dave & Buster's? It is the one from Dave & Buster's. I forgot to erase these names because I'm stupid. All right. He says it looks like a scratcher token. No, that's sitting over here. I don't know where it went, actually. It's over here somewhere. Yeah. Move my camera. No. Help. Yeah. Where is it? Oh, there it is. Haha. -ha. There's a scratcher coin right there, guys. How's that for, for a coin? Sucker's huge, too, guys. Shout out to Ticket Time, Carson, Trevor, and Mr. D. Cool guys. If you guys want to get a coin of theirs, just go to their Ticket Time channel and uh, check it out. They'll ship it to you for free. I think it's like 12 bucks or something for a coin. They're really nice coins, too. They're heavy as can be. Like, they're really freaking heavy. Like heavy listen listen to that <laughs> so anyways what's up arcade master what's happening how's the weather over there and everything just fell off the pile I have here so I gotta find somewhere else to put that stuff how about right there hi Leanne how's it going So guys, how's this is how's this is gonna go? And there's actually some secrets in the claw machine. 
Um, you guys can't see it. Because that's why I put this thing over top of it. So that way you guys can't tell what's inside. But there's going to be... Let's just say that some of these little things have coins in it to play in the coin pusher. How's that sound? So... Who wants to play the claw machine, guys? Who wants to play? Let's play the claw machine. Here's how we're going to do it. I think that Nightbot is active now. Let's see. Let's see if uh, Nightbot is active yet. Because I've got to wait till he comes around before we can do this. Obviously. Just remember, guys, if you want to super chat, it does help go to the channel. Um, it does help me do things like this, and then also uh, helps um, helps uh, uh, me to ship stuff to you guys when you win stuff, too. So, just remember that. Yeah, it looks like Nightbot's not awake yet. So, we gotta wait a few more minutes. Usually takes a couple minutes before he shows up. I don't know why, but... I guess it just takes time to detect that the stream is live and things like that. What's up, Fantastic Wit? I saw Beat Saber for the first time today. In, uh, main event here. And it had this really freaking cool, um... So, do you guys remember those old clocks that, like, had a wand on it that would swing back and forth and display the time on it? So this was a spinning wand. Like, spinning and really fast spinning and it looked like a holographic Beat Saber thing. It's on my Instagram. It's really cool looking. Uh, so it looks like a 3D holographic Beat Saber thing. Um, but yeah, it was like, wow, that looks cool. I wonder how that does that. And then I went around to the side and I'm looking at it and I'm like, oh, that makes sense. <laughs> <coughs> What's up, multi-talented man? Says, hey, Joe, it's been so long since I've caught a stream. Long-time fan and arcader myself. Great to be here. Thanks for coming by, man. Glad you got to catch one again. I do remember your name. It's been a while. Yes, indeed. What's up, Pika? Hopefully. Hopefully Nightbot wakes up here. Otherwise, we got to find another way to pick people to play. So how's everyone doing on this uh, Thursday? How's your last week of August going? Mine's going wonderful. New job search and all that good stuff. So, yeah. That's happening. <laughs> At Nightbot. Hello. <laughs> Is he here? We'll see. You know what's going to happen, too. When he does show up, he's going to catch up to all these commands that people are sending. There it is. Hey, Nightbot showed up. There he goes. Look, like I just said, he's going to spam the chat. He was going to show up and boom. <laughs> School is starting soon. September 3rd is the day. Woo! What's up, Jose? Leon says, well, it's 2 a.m. here, lol, so it's Friday now. Well, I appreciate you being here so late, Leon. I, forget that, I always forget that you're in the U.K., God, you're so so far ahead of us. I would love to take a trip over there one day. Maybe if this whole job thing works out, I might be able to <laughs> in yeah. the future. I wouldn't mind. I wouldn't mind taking trips, you know, every twice a year or so. You know, make some bank, make make some uh, make some bank. All right, so this is how it's gonna work, guys. Nightbot is going to randomly pick somebody in the chat. This person's going to get to play. So I was testing the claw earlier, and I found out that the little capsules that hold the... Hang on, let me show you here. The little capsules that hold the stuff inside of it. The claw was able to pick up with up to 12 coins in it, 12 dimes, which is actually pretty strong. I was really surprised. I tried 15 and it just, it would try to pick it up and it just couldn't do it. So I kept taking it away until it could fully hold it. 
and it was 12 was the magic number. So there is at least one capsule in this claw ma- or, yeah in the claw machine that has 12 coins in it. All the others have random from one to t- from the one to ten basically. Um, but there's more of the lower end ones obviously than there is a higher number. So Leanne says their rig's so bad. <laughs> Good luck winning on a claw machine here. Blade of Blazes says. If you could trap Matt3756 in a video game that he hates a lot, which game would it be? I don't know which video game he hates. I'll be honest. He likes so many games. I want to trap him in uh, Planet Coaster or whatever, Roller Coaster Tycoon. He would he would absolutely be in glory there. Until you put him on one of those coasters that you just crash. You know, one of the ones you purposely crash. The multi-talented man says, "What happens when the dimes are won? Well, when the, when if you win a capsule from the claw machine that has dimes in it, and I don't even know which ones. I'm not even gonna go. I'm not even gonna look when I'm playing it. I'm just gonna try to grab one. And there's prizes in there. There's shoutouts. There's Blu-rays. There's things like that. There's like one or two Blu-rays in there. I shook this thing up earlier. I could shake it up again if you want, but." I mean, if you guys think that I'm not being honest here, there, there's, I'll tell you right now, there are dimes on top, and there are dimes on the bottom, so it just depends, you know, what you grab, um, but, but when you win the dimes from there, we move them over to the coin pusher, you play the coin pusher. If you win one of the papers out of the coin pusher, you win one of those prizes. Now, those are actual prizes. There is no, like, shout-outs in the coin pusher. So this is like a double, double thing, guys. Now, if you want a guaranteed play on the claw machine, I hate to do this, but, I mean, it's just a way to, It like I said, it helps the channel, guys. You don't have to. It could be randomly picked by Nightbot. But a $5 donation will get you a guaranteed play on the claw machine tonight. So, and that's only open to like the first five people that get it. So, I got to limit it because otherwise we'd be going forever. (laughs) But that's, again, guaranteed you play on the claw machine. Whereas, Nightbot, you got to take your chances and you don't know if you're going to get picked or not. So... Kevin says you should do dime coin pushers. This is a rigged claw. It's not a rigged claw. What are you talking about? It's not a rigged claw. How's it rigged? But anyways, guys, there is one grand prize in the cl- in the uh, in the actual coin pusher and tonight. This is the grand prize right here. SNES Classic. Everybody loves this. Comes with all these awesome games on it. And it can be hacked to put more on. So yeah. If you get the grand prize, that would be the that would be the one. So Anyways, Leanne says, I need this, lol. Multitalent demand says, no way. John Doe says, what's with your hair? What do you mean, what's with my hair? What? It's a ponytail. Cowboy Gaming says, ooh, I need that for my collection. So. (laughs) So anyways, guys, let's pick the first player here. And again, I don't determine this. This is Nightbot picking someone from the chat randomly. Okay, I'm not even gonna. I'm not even gonna pay attention to what Nightbot says except for the name because Nightbot always says like, "Oh, this person's not subscribed" or whatever. It's so weird. But I'm gonna pick a winner, guys, and only I can type this command. So, um, but like I said, if you want a guaranteed play on the claw, guys, you can super chat five bucks, and uh, that'll get you a guaranteed. Plus, it's only open for five people, so. Um, like I said, that just helps with like stuff like when I give away prizes like this, shipping and helping with the you know uh, for the for the videos and stuff. Like you guys saw my ten dollar challenge, I won a twenty five dollar Best Buy gift card. Hello, <laughs> and I just bumped the microphone because I suck. All right, here we go. I'm gonna push the button in three, two, one, go Nightbot. 
Oh my goodness, Amber with a $5 super chat. <laughs> well, Nightbot has picked Fantastic Wit. And it says does not subscribe to this channel, which I know is crap. <laughs> oh my god. Dream Big Productions with a $21.02 super chat said we went to the arcade two nights ago and the results are unbelievable. FYI, the scores were tied. Peanut Butter Team scored 4,444 tickets and Jelly Team scored 4,444 tickets as well. We will play an overtime arcade battle soon. Oh my goodness. Thank you so much, Dream Big Productions. Amber says, always enjoy the videos. $5 super chat. Thank you so much, Amber. DB17. All right, so let's let's get this lined up here. We got Amber. DB17. And Dream. Big. Pro. Wow, I can't spell. P-R-O-D. Not P-R-O-U-D. D U C T I O N S. Dream Big Production slash plush bat fan. I love those plush bats, by the way. They're really nice. They're very solid, too. But thank you so much, Amber and Dream Big. Okay, so before the chats came in, I was picking a winner, so I do have to give Wit hers, her play first. Uh, Fantastic Wit did get picked by Nightbot, guys. And then we'll do Amber. And then we'll do Dream Big Productions. So let's move the camera over to the claw machine. And let's see what we win. And like I said, I put this little fun for all thing in there. You can see it kind of hides it, but not really. But you guys are going to watch me. I'm, I mean, you can't see my face, but I'm not looking at the claw machine. So we're just starting it. I'm just moving it over. I have no idea where I'm going. Get it open. We're going to swing it around in here. Let's go. Let's go this way. I'm hitting something. Hang on. Eh. Let's go right there. Let's see what we find. Get something. Oh, I didn't get anything. All right, let's try over here. Let's try there. Oh, I didn't get anything. Let's try over here. It's, it's hitting them, but it's not picking anything up. All right, let's try... Let's try right... No. All right, now I'm going to look because I can't freaking... Oh, we got one. All right, here we go. What's it going to be? All right. Well, unfortunately, wit is not a dime thing. I'm, I wish it was. I really do. But it is, let's see what's inside of here. And it is a shout out. So Fantastic Wit, thank you so much. We're going to put your name on the board back here. And we will leave this one, guys, out of the claw machine. As you can see, we're going to put it over here. So Kevin says, I'm sorry, I said it was a rig claw. It's not a rig claw. It's just, it's really, it's difficult to pick up stuff with it, guys. It really is. Uh, these little things that I bought, um, they're like the perfect size for the claw. As you can see, they, they fit in there perfectly. But, uh, yeah, so Fantastic Wit gets a shout out. Whoop. Not Fantastic Wit. Wow, what? I can't write. Look. I am so sorry, Fantastic Wit. F A N T. I'm so sorry, Fantastic Wit. For some reason, it said my, my hand decided to write fat instead of fant. F A N T. All right, so now you're on the board. There you go. You got an awesome shout out. I'm going to change that from saying super chatters to shout outs. How's that sound? But, uh. All right, let's go back to the claw machine. And now we're going to do Amber DB17. Um, so we're going to go back to the claw machine. Here we go. And excuse the mess over here, guys. This is just kind of, this is fan mail stuff still. Like, this is all the fan mail I've gotten and saved. Uh, I just haven't put it in the envelope yet. And then behind that are, like, all the Blu-rays and stuff. You guys can see the movies back here. So, um, all right, let's try this again. 
Let's see if we can get a dime one this time. That'd be cool. I'm not looking, I promise. Michelle can attest. I don't know where I'm even going in the claw machine. Maybe Michelle can play it. How's that sound? I didn't get anything. Oh, it's not opening. What the heck? There we go. Now it opened. Oh, come on. Yeah. Come on. Move. Go that way. No, go that way. Oh. All right, you know what we're going to do? Hold on. We're going to take this thing. I'm going to get a little shake here. I'm actually going to turn it upside down, guys. So that way the dimes still have a chance to be on top as well. And we're going to shake this up a little bit. And see if we can get some dimes up top there. And see what happens here. All right, here we go. Oh, let's see. Here we go. Oh, we got one. Wow, that was pretty quick. All it took was a shake. I can't tell what it is. It's got a yellow cap, though. All right. Oh, it's another piece of paper. Ah, uh, dang it. Where's all those dimes at, man? I put, like... 20 of them in there are dimes guys so uh no they're just dimes and like i said if you win them that we put them over here then into the coin pusher and you guys can see the pieces of paper that are in there to win so all right we just opened it and just to prove that we opened it here's the yellow cap and because here's the purple one still i promise and inside on the piece of paper guys it is a shout out Thank you so much, Amber. I apologize. We tried to get you some dimes. That's uh, that's unfortunate. But we're going to put you over there. And just to prove, guys, look. See, they're still sitting there. They're still sitting there. Look. There's my feet. Hi, feet. Yes, I'm wearing shorts. <laughs> All right. Uh, I really hope that I get another mini claw machine like that so that I can do a mini claw machine video. Gaming Master, these are actually pretty cool. And I'll tell you right now, I bought these things, like, here, I'll show you the whole bag of them I have. Like, I have a whole freaking ton of them. And it was, like, $5 on Amazon for all this. Like, there's, like, 250 or something in here. And, uh, yeah, 250 count here. In fact, here's the, here's the actual name of it. Let me show you. Here's the actual name of it right there. It says, uh, One Inch Empty Acorn Vending. Assorted colors, 250 count. So, uh, I got these guys. They're they're freaking. They were like five bucks on Amazon. <laughs> Excuse me. All right, Amber. I do apologize. We did try to get you a win, like a, a actual dime win. I mean, I don't know. I might take the papers out next time, guys. Oh, thank you for for the sneeze. The bless you, uh, George. You did say about the big knob fair. Unfortunately, I don't have any extra money right now, guys. Um, I was uh, let go from my job on Monday, and it's been a tough week. I've been on a couple interviews and things like that. So, uh, unfortunately, arcades right now and fairs are just extra money that I can't spend right now. So, unfortunately, um, that sucks. But it is what it is. I'm going to find another job, guys. We're going to be back up in no time. We'll, we'll be able to, you know get out there and have fun again uh it's just you know right now is not a great time <laughs> but again guys this is why I like the donations help and stuff because they help pay for like shipping prizes when they prizes go out things like that so but thank you guys so much man um cat girl christy says do you have paypal i do if you guys don't want to pay don't want youtube to take 30 percent you can go through uh, through PayPal. You can put it to. Uh, I'll give you the the address here. Give me a second. Let me type it into the. Um... Oh yeah, that's right. It might be a command on Nightbot. I think I already did that. I think Fantastic Wit might be correct there. Let's see. Did I do that one? I don't remember. Maybe it's that. I don't remember. I can't remember the commands. <laughs> 
If not, uh, I'm just going to put it in the chat here. If, if you don't want YouTube to take 30%, which they do, um, it's jjgeneral1 at comcast.net. So, yeah. There you go, guys. You can check out the commands there. Uh, let's see. Donation. Oh, it's it's donation, not donate. I was close. All right. Eric says, I didn't know you had Nightbot. Yes, yes. Do I like Minecraft? No. <laughs> um, David, what's up? Says, how are you doing? All right, guys. We're going to play for uh, Plush Batfan now. Uh, you know, Dream Big Production slash Plush Batfan. Although, I don't know if they're in the chat. But that's okay, because I talk to them regularly on Instagram. They actually send me... You guys saw their, their type-up about the peanut butter and jelly teams. I wish I knew who their teams were, like who they actually were behind the camera. It's really cool. But uh, they talk to me on Instagram all the time. They're really cool people. Kevin <laughs> says, do you have Instagram? I do. It's just JJ General one um, I don't know if I have social media on there or not. Under Nightbot. Maybe not. I don't know. Let me see. Yeah, social media. It's just, yeah, social media. That's it. It's all It's all one word. Yeah, there it is. Thank you so much, Chris, for typing that one. The Yeet Gamer says, got to go. Have a good rest of the stream, Joe. Thank you so much, Yeet Gamer. Thanks for coming by. All right, guys, let's play for plush bat fans slash dream big productions. Let's see what happens here. I can't tell what's even in there, guys. I can't see around the fun for all sign. I'll be honest. I made it difficult for myself. It's not moving. Oh, that well, was on top of something. We didn't get anything on that one. Let's try right there. Oh my goodness! Looks like we got one. We do. We got a white cap. All right. Let's see what's inside the white cap now. And it's a piece of paper, unfortunately. I didn't hear any dimes going. Oh, and it's another shout-out, guys. So, dang it. You know, I think next time I'm going to take all these papers out of here and I'm just going to put dimes in. <laughs> what do you guys think? Would that be a better... Guys, this is just something new that we're trying. It's a little different. Uh, it was actually suggested, I believe, by Flame Dragon. I believe Flame Dragon uh, suggested putting the dimes into there and then using them over there. So, Amber, you get a... Sh Shout out, and there goes my gold play button. And so we'll give you a star, and we'll give them a star. So now you guys have stars next to your name as well. And my freaking little charger. Oh, I forgot the camera battery was on that charger for like a week now. Ah, put that in there. Totally forgot. Oh my goodness, I got a holy crap. Christy, thank you so much for the PayPal. Uh, donation of $20. Thank you so much. Uh, you are awesome. Thank you so, so much. That that means a lot. Uh, that helps with a lot of stuff with the channel, guys. Seriously. Thank you, Cat Girl Christy. You are awesome. Holy crap, Ola, guys. I cannot believe that. It kind of like, you know, it touches my heart. You guys are awesome. Christy, thank you so much. Seriously. That was very, very nice of you. We're going to put you on the board back here. Cat girl Christy. Eric says, why did I comment yes? I don't know. Cat girl, G-U-R-L. Cat girl Christy. And you're on the board right there. And no, that's not my middle finger, guys. That's my ring finger, I promise. I'm just pointing with that finger. Thank you so much, Cat Girl Christy. Well, we can play for you. Let's see what happens on the claw machine. Hopefully, we get some dimes. I'd like to see the uh, the coin pusher go. So, um, Cat Girl says you're very welcome. I can't do in-app purchases, so no super chats. Well, that's okay. Thank you so much, though. Honestly, Cowboy Gaming says you're gonna crap a brick. No. <laughs> Crapping a brick is basically what I did whenever Flame Dragon super chatted me $100 when I was at Tilt Studios with DJ B. Wells and basically broke me. Um, 
I was so freaking taken back. Uh, just, just in shock. So, yeah. So, give me one second, guys. PJ, please. We're trying to stay happy tonight. Uh, I know it's a sad situation and everything, but please. Please. I understand that a trooper got shot and stuff, man. It's it's very sad. It's, uh, you know, someone gave their the ultimate sacrifice, but... Try to stay happy tonight. We're trying to stay happy stream, guys. Happy, happy. Ooh. Whoops, I just pulled the leg out of this uh, tripod. Huh. Good thing it goes back on real easily. <coughs> Excuse me. So, anyways, Christy, let's do a turn for you on the claw. So, all right, let's see if I could do this. Do you want me to shake it up? How's that for the question? Let's see if we can shake it up, maybe get some dimes on top. I think there's dimes on top. I think I see a couple. But who knows with this dang thing, man. Jess says, my sister Taylor is jumping on the couch. <laughs> Too bad you couldn't shake the real machines up, says the last unicorn. Hey, what's up, last unicorn? Long time no talk, man. I see you on Instagram all the time, dude. Your stories are freaking hilarious all the time. All right, we're going to shake it up a little bit. Shake it up. How's that Taylor Swift song go? Shake it off. Shake it off. Oh, I'm thinking of, uh, is it the cars I'm thinking of? Shake it up. Yeah. All right, come on. All right. There's got to be dimes on top now because I don't see papers on top. Let's do this. Let's get these, get these dimes. Here we go. Going for right in the middle here. If, I'm, if memory serves me correctly, I think there's a dime right here. Oh, we got a blue one. What's behind the fun for all? Ooh. Wait, what? Is that, it's not over all the way. What the heck's going on? Oh, ooh, did you hear that? Ooh, that sounds good. Ooh, that sounds good. Let's see. There are dimes in here. We have dimes. How many are in here now is the question. Yeah. Yeah. I finally uploaded my Horror Tariba unboxing video. All right, Dimes, let's see. We have two. <laughs> well, that was one of the lower ones, unfortunately. But, hey, you got two Dimes. You never know. So we're going to do like we did before, guys. If, if you get any extra, if you get any extra um, Dimes out of the coin pusher, then you can replay those. So here we go. Let's turn on the coin pusher. Let's turn it over here, and we're going to watch this. And there's a whole bunch right on the edge, especially right here. So, ooh, look at that. Ooh, look at that. Isn't that beautiful? All right, let's see if we can get a good push here, guys. Let's see what happens. Uh, Chris, this is Cat Girl Christie's turn. So let's see. We're going to try to put it in. You guys are going to watch it come down this side over here. Ready? Watch. Ooh, that looks... Oh, man. All right. Last dime. Here we go. Let's see what happens. Come on. Oh, that's flat. Oh, come on. Push. Oh, that one on the edge over here is so ready to fall off. Look at that. Top shelf. Oh, look at that. Oh, oh. I heard it fall. Oh, man. And you guys can see the tray is empty, so unfortunately... Wait, something else? Oh! Well, we had something fall. There we go. We got one. So, Christy, you get an extra dime. That's a plus. Let's see here. Which side would you like to put it in, Christy? Left or right? Let me know. Yeah, there's no skill stop, unfortunately, unless you, like, you know, come over here and turn the knob and turn it off. <laughs> So, she says left. All right, we're going to put it in the left. You can see up here, I'm putting it in the left side. See how there's two holes? That one's just when I load, like, the papers in. I just don't know where the cover went. <laughs> so, all right, here we go. Going down that left side. Here we go. 
And three, two, one, drop. Ooh, that's flat. Ooh, good push. Oh, it got stacked. Oh, it got stacked on that lower lower level there. And yeah, paper moved. Wow, look at that. Ah, oh, man. I think that's it, Christy. Oh, I can hear stuff moving. Oh, I see what it is. The the paper on those dimes is moving right there. That's what's making noise. <laughs> oh, well, unfortunately, Christy, we did not get anything else out of there. We tried. At least you got dimes. Got to play the, the coin pusher, so that was pretty cool. Um, Blade of Blaze says, why does the stream keep stopping? Does it stopping for anyone else? Because I've been green the whole time on YouTube. I don't know about you guys, but it's been it's been green on uh, on my screen the whole time, which means perfect health. So, Gaming Master says, I love coin pushers. Anna says, what's going on? Okay, so Anna, what we're doing is, I'm picking, um, Nightbot is uh, picking a random, um, random winners okay that i pick that i type the command and then nightbot says hey pick the winner um but uh we still have two more spots available i opened it to five people for a five dollar at least a five dollar donation i had some people give more and they're very much appreciated uh dream big productions gave a 21 uh or yeah 21 dollar and two cent donation and uh cat girl christy gave a 20 dollar paypal donation so thank you so much. And then Amber, DB17, gave a $5 donation. So thank you very much for those. Uh, Anna says, I just got here. It hasn't stopped for me. Well, that's good. I'm glad it has, hasn't stopped for you guys. Maybe uh, maybe Blade of Blazes needs to refresh. That's a chance, possibly. So a dinker. Yes, a dinker. I'm going to put my microphone, guys. I have this. Check us out. So that when I record on my camera, guys, this is my camera here. Real little, nothing little. You know camera I have this wireless microphone okay this attaches to my belt and then the wire runs up and I clip it on my shirt like this okay I'm gonna take this actual microphone and I'm gonna put it inside a coin pusher tray and I'm gonna record the sound of a, a coin dropping kind of like Matt did for him when he used to do his uh, coin pusher videos the intro to it and um, I'm gonna kind of use that for stuff so that would be really cool. What's up, Tony? The Arcade Dad. What's happening? If you guys don't subscribe to the Arcade Dad, please check him out. Uh, <laughs> oh, here comes the <laughs> the Nightbot command for Arcade Dad. Um, <laughs> guys, also check out the rest of the Claw Council at clawcouncil.com. Definitely uh, lots of awesome people there. So, like... Nola Fam Arcade, Drew the Midway Maniac, Dragon Claw Games, myself, and the Arcade Dad. Ooh, I hear sirens outside. There's a siren out there. Almost. I can almost do it. ClockCouncil.com. Who no? No, I'm just kidding. All right, so because we got through our donations now, like I said, there's still two more spots available for the five dollar donation uh, to play the claw machine. It's a guaranteed play on the claw machine, guys. We're gonna do a night bot pick for the next uh, next player. So again, guys, donations are not not required, but they just help with everything. You know, with the operations of the channel, if you will. But thank you guys to those who have donated so far. Thank you so much. All right, let's see who Nightbot picks now. Oh, we have 33 people watching. This is awesome. Uh, do you like the song called Old Town Road? Gonna take my horse down the Old Town Road. I'm gonna ride till I can no more. And this guy can't sing a song at all. He can't carry a tune. So anyways... <laughs> All these notifications. I just want to make sure I don't miss any like PayPal notifications or anything. If you guys decide to go that way, just remember, guys, there is the uh, that route as well. So that way, YouTube does not take thirty percent. All of it goes to myself. Uh, it helps out with everything. But like I said, it's not necessary. 
but it's much appreciated if you do. So um, I keep looking up here because my camera used to be up here. I have it on a tripod now so I could show the games. And I... <laughs> you guys think I'm farting. But I'm not. So anyways... Um... Anna says, I disagree, Joe. You carried a couple of notes. <laughs> so that's not funny because I put my hands together off camera and it went like that. And you guys maybe thought that, whew, thought that something happened, uh, you know, back here. But that's not the case. <laughs> it's my hands. I'm just really good at it. And I'm going to tell you guys how I did that after I picked the next winner, how I learned how to do that. So there we go. Let's pick the winner. All right, here we go. We're going to push the button in, oh, let's see, three, two, one. Now, you guys usually probably see the chat before anything else. Oh, my goodness. Arcade Dead with a $5 super chat says, boom. And let's see who the winner is. Nightbot. Oh, Gaming Master. All right, so we got to add the Arcade Dead to the, to the board here. And then he's actually going to play first, and then, and then Gaming Master will play after. The Arcade Dad. And he's really good with dad jokes, too. No, I'm just kidding. Thank you, Tony, for the $5 super chat. So awesome. Guys, check him out. He, uh, he says, no, I know play that's just for you, broski. No, you play, and you're going to like it. You're going to take it, and you're going to like it. Let's try to win you something, Tony. Let's see what happens. There might be some dimes on top. We can play the coin pusher. So let's see. Leon <laughs> says, damn you, Nightbot. I'm sorry, I can't control Nightbot, guys. He's random. I'm sorry. All right, you guys like my little, uh, you like my little uh, coin mechanism operator? It's a flathead screwdriver that you just put in the slot here and go, activate. <laughs> All right, Tony, let's get you a win here. Let's move it on back here, and we'll drop it about right there. Ugh. Oh, wait, I forgot to ask Tony if he wanted to shake it. Shake it up. Oh, come on. Oh, look at this. It's not picking them up. You know what? Let's move it this way. Let's see if I can get it on this one. No, what the crap, yo? Ooh. Oh, I almost had it. Come on. Oh, this is getting ridiculous now. If time runs out, we shake it up. Damn, I thought I was going to get it that time. Well, womp, 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 womp. Well, shake it up. Let's see. You guys can hear the, the dimes in there. Listen. There's a lot of dimes in there, guys. All right. There we go. Let's reactivate it. Uh, claw machine powers. Activate. All right, let's go for this one right on top. No. Oh my god! I can't get it. All right, let's go over here. Let's get this one. Come on. I'm looking now, guys, because I can't freaking tell what it's grabbing and what it's not. Oh, come on. That was absolutely a grab. There we go. We got a grab. We got one. It's hidden behind the fun for all sign, guys. What could it be? Oh, oh, it's in the prize chute. Ooh. Ooh. Do you hear that? What's inside of there? Sounds like money. Yeah. And it is a single lonely dime. <laughs> Sorry, Tony, but you get one dime at least on the on the coin pusher, so we'll slide the camera over there. How's that sound? I know, it's one. Sorry, guys, like I said, it ranged from one to ten-ish, and with like one twelve in there, so 
I'm sure the 12 is probably at the bottom because it's heavy. All right, Tony. You get the pick. Left or right side? I'll give you a better view here. Hang on. Which one do you want to put it in, Tony? Left or right? Gosh, damn it. <laughs> I think that may have been my dime, says Amber. <laughs> Tony says, let's go right. Okay. Okay. So up here, we're going to put it in the right side one. And here we go. You're going to watch it come down. See those little things swinging back and forth, guys? It comes out of there. We're going to try to move the camera down as we go. All right. Three, two, one, drop. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, the paper moved, but nothing else. Well, you knocked the paper off the top of the back shelf there, guys. So you, you, we, we did that. But it doesn't look like anything else is moving, unfortunately. Oh, man, and these ones were so close to come off, too. Ah, oh, dang it. Well, sorry, Tony. We tried. So we turn off the coin pusher. It's still moving that paper. That paper's still, like, flinging back there kind of funny <laughs> all right tony you had your play now uh fantastic wit if you want this coin push it's actually like 50 55 bucks on on amazon really <laughs> arcade dead says yes i don't get punished <laughs> all right gaming master it is your turn my friend it is your turn if i remember correctly if that's who Nightbot picked. Of course it was. So let's see what the claw machine does for Gaming Master, guys. Let's see. Do you guys like how I put this up here so you can't really tell what you're getting? Like it's hidden behind with the claw and everything. It's a mystery to everybody, right? All right, let's do this. All right, Ma Magic Activator, activate. <laughs> I'm so stupid. It's not even funny. All right, let's go for this one right here. No, not that one. No, not that one. Go for this one. Yes. Yes. No. Yes. We got one. Ooh, we got one, guys. It's green. Ooh, there it is. Ooh, can you guys hear that? Oh, what's in there? Uh, eh. All right. There are dimes. Now the question is, how many? Let's see. Eh. We have two dimes. So, yeah, I'm going to take all the paper ones out of here for next time, guys. We're just going to have all dimes in there. So that way you guys can play the coin pusher every time. Um, I think it was a good idea to try, but now we tested it. Now we can see that it's eh, not the greatest, but it's all right. We tried. All right. Gaming Master, you got two dimes, my friend. Which side do you want to put them in, left or right? Or do you want to split it? You let me know. So let's see. Which side he wants to put it in. I'm just shaking them in my hand. Right by the microphone. So you guys can hear it. Um, let's split it and go one on both sides. Alright, we'll do one at a time. Which one do you want to do first? Left or right? Which one do you want to do first? Do, 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 do. All right, right first. All right, we're going to put the right one up here, and we're going to drop it. I'm not even looking. My eyes are closed. I swear to God, my eyes are closed. Michelle will tell you. I'm looking at the light in the ceiling. I'm going to count down and go three, two, one, drop. I don't even know when I dropped it. I don't know where it went. I missed it. I'm looking at the light in the ceiling. All right. 
I don't know where that one went. I can't tell you where it landed. I have no clue. <laughs> I wasn't looking. Only you guys know. Um, all right. Let's do the left side now since you wanted to split it. And see if we can get... There's a whole bunch hanging right here. These... It doesn't look like it, guys. But these are seriously, look, right over the edge. Look at that. They're so close. All right. It went into the machine, says the arcade dad. All right, last time, up on the left side, we're going up over here. Here we go, as I bump the machine. All right. It went on the far left side on the right side pusher. Oh, uh, did it get stacked or something? There's a nice stack there, I see. All right, here we go. We're going to drop it in three, two, one, drop. Oh, you got that push. Oh, come on, these are hanging. Oh. You got to love the physics of coin pushers, man. Look at this. Look how far over the edge they are. Look at that. That's ridiculous. That was a good push, though, man. You had an awesome push. I really thought these two right here were going to go on the edge. These, these two right here. I thought for sure they were going to go. Oh, man. I was really hoping... Even these toy ones are awesome. Yeah, they're a lot of fun. And here's the thing, guys. They come with these, like, plastic coins. But, I mean, that doesn't... That's not really fun. You know, plastic coins are blah. I like using real coins. That's why I use dimes, because they're about the same size as these plastic coins. So... But, uh... I guess you could call that defying gravity. Yeah! It's doing that thing, man. That coin pushers do, you know? All right, turn off coin pusher. All right, gaming master, I apologize. We did try. Let me see. Move my microphone back over here. Um, J. Davy says, shove some mini marbles in here and put some furry cats in the back wall. Marble carnival without going to round one and playing nine credits a pop. <laughs> yeah, but I don't have that awesome spin thing, you know. That would be a cool coin pusher to like a home coin pusher to marble one. I would, I would freaking. That would be cool as crap, man. But you would need about a thousand marbles in it because if you hit the five hundred, you need enough on the play field and enough in the in the stock to make sure that you can shoot them all. But that would be cool as a as a home pusher, man. And so loud. I would love to play that game. I don't know if we have it up here at round one in Erie. I gotta talk to Dragon Claw Games since they were there. Maybe they saw it. I don't know. Uh, Gaming Master says, I was so close to winning. And that one paper is moving up on that coin pusher, guys. Look at that. That that middle paper, and even the one on the right side there, is moving up a little bit. So they were way back whenever we started. And so it's amazing how just a few coins can push those forward. So, all right. Um, we're going to play again. We're going to have Nightbot pick. Guys, If the thing is, if Nightbot has already picked you and it picks you again, we have to we have to pick again. It's just fair for everybody if we give everyone a chance to play, uh, especially if you've already played. Um, but there is one more spot available, guys. If anyone, if you want to super chat, get your guaranteed play on here. Uh, there's one more spot available for the super chat. So thank you guys so much to those that have super chatted. Um, but anyways, let's see who Nightbot picks. We're going to type it in, but I'm not going to push enter yet. We're going to give it a second. Hopefully it's like randomizing, although I don't think it is. What's up, Clayton? All right, let's see here. When should I push the button? There's four minutes left in the Steeler game. We're going to do it right now. Four minutes was exactly on the dot. There we go. And the winner is Chris Allen. So Nightbot has picked Chris Allen. All right, Chris. Let's see what we can do. Chris is like, yeah, all right. Um, all right, that's cool. Awesome. Let's see. Let's play some claw machine. Let's get our claw machine activator out there. Our nice little, you know, tool fox screwdriver. It used to have a little thing on the end that you can actually, like, hold it and it would twist in your hand, but that kind of broke off. El Cheapo. I got it for free. What can you say? All right. Claw machine activate. Let's find you a good one here. 
And I can't even tell because I'm looking at the camera to play, so I don't even know where the claw is at. Like, I can see it, but it's behind the fun for all sign. I'm looking over when it goes up to know if I grab something or not. Oh, we almost had one there. Oh no! What the heck's going on, Claw? Oh, that chain's getting all binded up. Oh, we almost had it. Ooh, come on. It's trying. Oh man, we almost had one again. Oh, we got one. Hurry up, get to the prize shoot. Hurry, 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 hurry. Hurry, hurry, hurry. All right, we got one. Oh, uh, Chris Allen, don't worry, dude. It's a glitch of Nightbot. Uh, it just says that nobody is freaking subscribed for whatever reason. Um, all right, Chris, we got one. Unfortunately, there's a paper inside, but there could be a prize. There's still prizes in this one, too. So don't forget, guys, there are still prizes in here besides shout-outs and everything. So let's see what's inside. Let's pop this open. And we have... Oh, man. And you guys remember, we shook this thing up, too. So unfortunately, it is a shout-out. But hey, you know what? A shout-out's better than nothing. Remember, guys, I'm writing your name on the board back here behind me. And the board goes out on social media, so you guys will get to see your name on social media as a supporter. So thank you so much. And then also, thank you so much to Nola Mum. She claimed the last spot for the claw machine for a $5 super chat. Thank you so much, Nola Mum. So we're going to put uh, Chris Allen on here. Oops. I, am, I forgot the second L. I've tried to write A-L-E-N. Chris Allen and then Nola Mom 08. Thank you guys so much. Let me pop this back on here so I don't write on myself. And there you are. Chris Allen is on the board underneath the arcade dead. And there's Nola Mom 08. Nola Mom 08, like I said, claims the final spot for the five guaranteed spots to play. So let's see if we can get dimes for her. Now, Nola Mom, before we played Claw Machine, I should have said this for Chris, too, but being that we had just shooken it up not too long ago, do you want to shake it up or do you want to go for how it is? That's the question. Uh, Thundy Fan says, congrats to everyone so far. Uh, Leanne says, no love, for the, or, no love for the UK right now. I don't control Nightbot. I can't help it. I'm sorry. Um, so, guys, that's the last paid spot, but I think we'll do, like, one or two more of the of the winner for for nightbot so you still have a chance if you haven't won yet guys you still have a chance definitely and again any more super chats or anything that like that are very much appreciated not necessary but thank you guys so much to everyone who did uh nola mom would you like to shake it shake it up that's a song by the cars man I would have left it how it was, so no worries, says Chris Allen. Oh, well, that, I mean, there's I see dimes in there. I'm looking at it right now. I see dimes in there. So we were close, actually. I think the one that you picked up, I think, was right next to a thing of dimes. And I hate to say that, but it's there. <laughs> Gaming Master says, hey, JJ Jordan, did you put me on the whiteboard? Did I win a spot on the claw earlier since Nightbot picked me? Uh, so that would be a shout-out, Gaming Master. If you got the shout-out, it would be on here. So... But because you got dimes, you got to play the, the coin pusher. So, yeah. That's how that worked. So, hope that answers your question. All right, I guess we're going to leave it how it is. Maybe Nola Mum, we're just going to leave it how it is and stare at fun for all 21,000 tickets. You guys will buy this for 21,000 tickets, right, at fun for all? <laughs> that was how many tickets the one set of uh, Power Beats headphones were at Fun For All. I got to keep the little sticker. I took it home. Mom goes, shake it up. Why not? All right, we'll shake it up. I had the uh, activator here ready, but it's okay. We'll shake it up. Let's see what happens. 
hope I'm not like busting any of them open in here. Um, there is one yellow lid in here. You guys can see it right there. Uh, right there. See that one yellow lid right behind this red one? It came off of one. I fetched the, uh, the, the empty one out, but the lid is still in there. I wasn't able to get it out. So, all right. Let's give it another good little here. And down and there. Those are stacked up pretty good. All right, let's get the activator out. And we are activated. Let's see if we can get some dimes, maybe. Ooh, that whole pile. Hang on, I gotta move it over. Sorry, I just had to move it over a little bit because they were they, like the claw wasn't reaching them. Oh, wow. Ugh. It's trying, man. Oh, come on. There's one standing up right here. It's just not grabbing it. Let's try again. There's one right there, and it's just, it's not grabbing it. I don't know why. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, there it is. We got it. Ooh, we got one. What's in it? That was a heavy fall, man. Heavy freaking fall. Ooh, that's heavy, too. All right. Let's see what's inside. You guys can hear it. Let's see how many's inside here. You know what, you know what that sound is. All right, let's see. There are... A couple. Four dimes. One, two, three, and four. Four dimes right there. So you know what that means. We get to move over to the coin pusher. Sorry, guys. I'm missing the chat here. Let me catch up a little bit. What's up, Christine Savage fam? Uh, Fantastic Wit says, I need to redeem for a neck massager. <laughs> RC Man says, have you seen any good movies lately? Uh, I finally watched The Last Jedi. I watched Star Wars The Last Jedi finally. Does that count? Um, but no, Mom, we got four dimes for you. That's totally awesome that came out of there. Huh? <laughs> Michelle goes, woo, no, Mom. Um, yeah, so how do you want to do these, no, Mom? We're going to go over to the coin pusher. And do you want to put them on the left side, the right side? Let me show you the coin pusher here. Ooh, this thing's getting loose. i got to tighten it up just for me spinning this thing around. All right, let's turn this on. And okay, thank you. Let's see which side Nola Mom wants to put them in. I told you guys there's more than like two in there. I promise. I think the one with twelve and it's all the way at the bottom. I think it's just so heavy that it's just sinking to the bottom of the of the claw machine. Unfortunately. Uh, so Nola Mum, doesn't look like you're live. If you want to try to refresh live just so you're caught up, looks like you're a little behind in your chats there. Um, Fantastic Wit says, ooh, I know where I'd go. It's a tough split right now because you got these ones on the right-hand side that are hanging over, and you got these ones on the left-hand side that are hanging over. And just remember, if anything goes down into the tray, you get extras, so... Oh, we're losing. Yeah, we were getting our. We were losing. It was seventeen sixteen, for a while. Amber DB seventeen says, "Did you guys ever get a chance to check out the arcades at Geneva on the lake yet? Been, been telling Matt or Arc Matt about. It. They have fascination there as well. No, but I did check out this place, guys. Check us out. There's this place in Erie called Playport. Okay, it's an arcade that basically has redemption and stuff and glow golf." 
Um, but check it out. So it's like you buy a wristband, okay? And you can actually do, like, unlimited. Look, unlimited stay and play. You can leave and come back and play all day long. Literally all day long. So if you guys are ever up there, guys, check them out. Playport. It's near Prescott Park. It's a, it's on West 12th Street in Erie, Pennsylvania. Uh, tell them I sent you because they'll give you a little discount, actually. They'll probably give you a couple dollar discount on your, uh, on your wristband. So if you guys do go there, definitely. And they also have the VR arcade, too. So they have this huge... Um, Nola Mum says left. All right, we'll go to left. See which whoa! I bumped the coin pusher. I almost freaking dropped them in there for her. All right, left coin, first coin. Here we go. We got three to go. We're just gonna put it in randomly. I'm not even looking. One, two, three, drop. Oh, it's in the corner. Oh, I think it got stacked up. That ended up over here. I did watch where it fell that time. I did look that time. <laughs> All right, Noel Mum says left again. All right, we'll do the second coin to the left. All right, we'll do three, two, one, drop. Ooh, that's good. It's flat. Oh, there. Go. Come on. Oh my God, look at that. Oh my God. Oh, one fell from over here. Not even on the left side. That one fell from the right side. So you got an extra one there. So that's pretty cool. I right, know, Mom. You got two more of your original, and then you have one in the tray as well. So, where do you want your next one to go? You got your third and fourth dime still. Would you like to play it on the left or the right? Gaming Master says I would probably put them all on the left side since when I played, I got a pretty good push on the left side. There's a good chance, absolutely. But you guys gotta remember, you're trying to go for these papers too, because these papers are the actual prizes. So. Uh, Nolan Mum says, I don't know, you pick. Well, let's let Michelle pick. Michelle, do you want to go left or right? right? Michelle says right. Okay, next dime will go to the right. Michelle says right. We let Michelle pick this one, so if it doesn't work out, that's on her. Tell me when to drop it. Now. now. All right, that looks good. Oh, flat. Oh, my goodness. Well, you heard that. She's got more in the tray. Well, you got one more left. This is your original still. You got your fourth one. Here we go. Let's see what happens. No, I, got, I was telling Michelle when to drop it, not, not you guys. Thank you, though, for chatting. Guys, you got to remember, the, the chat's like a little bit behind the actual stream, like what I'm doing. It's a couple seconds behind. So um, do you want to do left or right, Nola Mum? Do you want to keep going right? Because those papers are getting close. Or do you want to let Michelle pick again? <laughs> That's going to be a good coin pusher setup. Here we go. Penny's halfway up in the bag. <laughs> oh, yeah, she's up in there. Well, now she pulled out, but hold on. Watch her. Watch, watch, watch. Here she goes. Here she goes. Look at her head. Her whole head's up in there. She's digging hard. All right, Nola Mum says right. All right, here we go. We're going to go right. Now, this is the last one of your original that came out of the little capsule from the claw machine. So, here we go. And Michelle, call it when to drop it. Oh, it got stacked. That's okay, though, because you still have three more down in the tray here. So, Noel mom has got three more chances here. That's crazy, isn't it? Look at this. Three more chances, guys. Three more dimes came out the bottom. So, Nolum, um, left or right? Same question every time. <laughs> we only got two choices. Fantastic Wit says, go Ashley with the money bag emoji, like the money sign emoji. RC Man says, arcades equals gambling for kids at heart. Yeah, pretty much. Pretty much. Little mom says, thank you, Wit. <laughs> uh, you're having a good game here, Nola Mom. She is. She's actually, she's like, left, right, left. Okay, we'll do left, right, left. 
All right, first one left. Michelle, tell me when. No. Now. Oh, it got stacked up. All right, next one's right. Let's see if we can do this timing right. I'm going to try to help her out. I'm going to try to do this. Here we go. Oh, I got stacked up. All right, left, right, and then left again. All right, here we go. Go and left again. You got a good chance of getting these ones right here. These ones definitely have a have a chance to uh, fall off. Here we go. Oh, I got stacked up again, man. I think that's going to be it for the play. Oh, man. It's got all these colors going. Give it a second here. Uh, looks like nothing, unfortunately. So we're going to go ahead and turn it off. Save battery power on there, guys, because these things run off uh, 4D batteries. So, And as I was saying, guys, check out Playport Erie if you're ever up there. It's on uh, West 12th Street in Erie. Worth it. Trust me, I was there. It was so much fun. And in fact, the one dude, the one dude who works there recognized me from the very first time that I met Matt, guys, in Edinburgh. If you guys remember uh, the Matt's one meet and greet video from Nick's Place in Edinburgh, PA, it was four years ago Matt put it out. Um, the dude that was helping him film, his name is Corey. Um... He's like, I walked in there and I was telling him what I did and everything, handed my business card. Uh, the girl that was working, her name's Sam, and uh, her mom owns the place. And she goes, she's like, oh, I'll let her know and everything. And Corey was sitting in there and he goes, you look really familiar, man. He goes, I don't know why. He goes, but you look really, really familiar. And I started explaining him what I did and everything. He goes, do you know Matt? And I said, yeah. And he goes, were you at edinburgh at nick's place and i said yeah and he goes dude i was there too and i'm like oh my god it took me a second then my mind processed his face and said you're the one that filmed for matt that helped him out that day isn't that cool like small world man like what are the chances okay so this dude runs the vr arcade in the back okay so he was on there all day he said and the time that i walked in was like his only time he was up front there all day and just, what are the chances of that? Like, fate just worked out that way, you know? Isn't that crazy? But anyways, Playport Arcade, guys. If you, if you do, definitely get up to Erie. If you're in Erie, Pennsylvania, check them out. Really cool. Tell them I sent you. They're, they're really cool. And they Like I said, they might give you a discount. I said that I'm going to try to send fans there and stuff. I may have a meet and greet there. They were really open to that idea. And they, they were open to, if I do have a meet and greet, during the meet and greet hours, you guys would get like a 3 or $4 discount on your wristbands, which would be really cool. Um, okay, Dad says, oh crap, I gotta go set up my stuff. I just got back home from Ohio and got some work on the craft to do tonight. The Minecraft. Guys, Tony will be streaming tonight. Check him out, streaming on Minecraft, doing his mining. Um, so anyways, guys, we're going to do one more claw machine play because it is already quarter after 10 and i'm technically on call with the fire hall so of course i don't even have my minute on me it's in the back on a charger but anyways let's uh let's go ahead and get nightbot ready primed and see who we pick to win arcade says let me know when you're done don't want to overlap you're having a good uh, don't want to overlap you have a good one man Tony, no worries. I will let you know when we're done. I'll shoot you a quick message on your Discord. And, uh, so yeah. Toemaster says, hashtag pager. <laughs> why does the boneless eggs hatched? Wait, why does the boneless eggs hatched? Because they were cracked up. Wait. I'm, I'm, I'm confused on that one. Wait, I'm confused. So is Michelle. Don't worry. I'm, I'm not the only one. Why did the boneless eggs hatch? Is that what you mean? Because they were cracked up. Is that? Is, I think that's what you meant, David. I'm sorry. I just my brain isn't processing it right now. Um, but anyways, hope you guys are enjoying this stream. If you are, please give it a thumbs up, guys. Don't forget to subscribe too. Take a moment right now. Please give it a thumbs up. Give it a subscribe if you're not already. 
And thank you so much for everyone for hanging out and watching tonight. I hope you guys are having fun. Chris Allen says, wasn't pagers a thing in the past? Well, the fire hall miniter is also known as a miniter pager. It beeps whenever the tones go off. So there's a set of two tones and it decodes the tones and there's a whole technical issue to it. So I know how it works. I just don't feel like describing it right now. <laughs> in fact, I used to program them and change them myself. Um, anyways. <laughs> All right. We got the chat primed. And Gaming Master says, I got to go to bed now. Everybody, see you on the next stream. Yes, I understand, guys. If you have to go, I do understand that. Some of you guys are younger. Some of you guys are in school. It's a Thursday night. Some of you guys, school starts Tuesday because um, Monday's Labor Day. I don't think anybody's in school on Monday. But um, I fully understand if you if you have to go, guys. No worries here. I'm not going to hold anything against you. You were here. You supported. You watched. That's all that matters. Thumbs up matter. Really, to YouTube, it, they do. Uh, thumbs up means more than anything. Thumbs up, thumbs down, or comment. Seriously, means more to, than anything to YouTube right now because it's engagement. YouTube is looking for engagement on videos. That's the biggest thing. That's why we ask you guys to like it all the time. So, that is why I start on the 3rd, but I'm good until 10.30 for the rest of summer vacation. <laughs> well, there you go. All right, here we go. We're going to pick a winner. Maybe maybe it'll pick one of the UK people if you're still with us, guys, because that means, that means it would be 3 a.m. over there right now, 3.15. Oh, my God. It's so late. Who's going to win, says Clayton, and multi-talented man says, I like the stream, by the way. Thank you, guys, seriously, for the thumbs up. That's totally awesome. I can't see him, unfortunately, in this version. Um, I don't know why they don't show us it, but... I can see watching. I can't tell how many thumbs up there are. So. All right. Three, two, one. Push the button. And let's see who Nightbot picks. And it is. Waiting. Well, Fantastic Wit. Well, we already have Fantastic Wit, so we got to pick again. Man, Nightbot was like, he was delayed there for a second. It took a minute. Well, they're doing away with it even more now with abbreviated analytics starting now. Yeah, of course. Of course. Well, okay, so Fantastic Wit already won. We'll, we'll pick another winner. And three, two, one, push the button now. And let's see what happens. What's up, Studmaster? The winner is Thundefan08, NBA44. There you go. He's like, yes! Yes! Score! Jess says, I'm back. I was watching JoJo Siwa. Oh. I can't stand those Nickelodeon stars that take advantage of little kids like that. We don't take advantage of little kids. Not on here. We just entertain. That's all we do. We don't even we barely even get paid for it, man. Ad revenue. <laughs> the junky ad revenue, you know, of YouTube anymore. All right. Sunday Fan 08 NBA 44. Let's go to the claw machine and we got to tilt the camera down because Otherwise, you guys would be staring at the ceiling. All right, I'm going to give you the option, like everyone else. Do you want to shake it or do you want to activate it? Shake it or activate? Woo, woo, woo. He says shake it. All right, let's shake it up. Shake it up. I gotta sing that song every time. I'm sorry. Alright. We're shook up. I'm shook. Alright, here we go. And activate. I gotta pull it up so I can put it down. Let's see what we can go for here. 
go right there. Oh, we got one on the first try. Wow. Let's see what happens here. Ah. It didn't register. There we go. All right. It's got a pink top. Uh, I don't hear any rumbling in there. I'm shaking it. All right. There we go. Let's see what's inside here. And a piece of paper. And on that piece of paper, it says shout out. So Thundee fan 08 NBA 44, thank you so much for your support. We're gonna put you on the board back here. Put that aside. And we're gonna put you on the board. Let's do it. Where's my where's my thing? Oh there it is. It was sitting under the camera. Alright, let's see. Let's make sure I can write your name right. <laughs> T H U N D E E F A N O eight N B A forty four. Wow, that's like a long one. That's almost like Dream Big Productions slash plush bat fan. There he is, Thundee Fan 08 NBA 44. There you go. You're on the board. And guys, remember, this board does get posted to um to Instagram, Twitter, Facebook. So the picture of this will go on to social media so you guys will see your name out there and everyone gets to see who supports the channel. Well, you guys all support the channel, I'm going to say, but you guys win the support or, you know, have donated. So thank you so much, guys. What if you painted or put colored tape around the capsules? That way you won't know what's in them. Hmm, that's a good question, Fantastic Wit. That might take a little bit because there's a ton of them. Uh, then you could see to play. Yeah, that, I can see your point there, Fantastic Whip, but that would just that would be a lot of work. <laughs> I don't know if I have it in me for that, to be honest. I mean, they're already like kind of vague enough. Like you can kind of see they have a little bit of a like a gloss to them. See, there's like a little bit of a gloss to them. So. They're not, they're not completely clear. They have like a, see, see like my finger behind it. See how it's all like fuzzy. So there's definitely a gloss behind it. But I mean, you can definitely tell which ones have dimes and which ones have paper in them, at least right now. Uh, I think in the future, I think we'll just do all dimes and leave the prizes in the coin pusher. That way it makes it a little harder to, to win the prizes. But we're going to also have shout outs in there then too. So again, that's the, that's the toss up. So. Or that's the uh, the trade-off, should I say. So there's going to be more papers in the coin pusher, but some of them are going to say shout-out in there. So it's it's a it's a trade-off. What can I say? It's the best I can do, guys. I'm sorry. I wish I could do so much more. I really do. But uh, I haven't seen any other PayPal donations, so I think we got that covered. Thank you to everyone who donated Super Chats on here. Thank you so much. Arcade Dad says, okay, I'm back. Well, we're about to about to end it here really, really shortly. But um, I'm really hoping to meet up with Dragon Claw Games tomorrow. Uh, they want to meet up at Fun For All. Unfortunately, I have an interview with a potential job tomorrow. Actually, this is a third part of an interview. So all the fingers crossed. All the fingers crossed. Hoping for that new job. Um... And we'll see what happens. But <laughs> Arcade Dad says, well, crap, that means i got to go do stuff. <laughs> uh, Colton says, thank you, JJ, for the shout-out. No problem. Thank you so much, Thundee fan 8 nba Good luck tomorrow, man. I hope you get it. Thank you, Arcade Dad. Congratulations to everyone who got the chance to play. Yes, multi-talented man. Sorry to you guys who did not get picked by Nightbot. I do apologize. It is a totally random pick. I, I don't control it. I have no way to say, hey, pick this person, pick that person. I mean, look, I'll just do it randomly right now. Watch. I have no control of who it picks. And watch it be one of the UK people. Ready? Oh, look, it picked Thundy fan again. <laughs> See, so I have no control over that, guys. And, and something stuck to my foot here. One of my clawy bags. Um, oh, somebody heard a bag and decided to come running over to the edge of the cage. Oh, somebody asked early on in the stream how the girls are doing. They're doing just fine. 
uh, still little buttheads. Um, in fact, Penny got me good. You see this nice little scratch right here? See this a scratch going up my neck? She got me yesterday. That hurts. That that one that one hurt, guys. Look, I'll show you. Look at that. Ugh, that hurt. She was like freaking out on me. I was holding her, and she was freaking out on me, and she was yanking my shirt and on her, and she's up here, and she was yanking on my on my like chewing on my shirt, like oh. And I was like holding on to her, like don't jump off of me. Like I had to hold her tight, and she was freaking out. And of course, I think I figured out why she was freaking out because as soon as I put her in the cage, she peed for like twenty seconds. So she really had to pee apparently. But she could have been like a little antsy, not like that antsy, but like okay, okay, I get it. You gotta go pee. <laughs> but yeah, that 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 hurt a little bit, guys. That that one stung just a little bit right there. Um, it was it was enough. <laughs> Fantastic one says, "Wow, Penny, why you do that to Daddy?" <laughs> Arcade Dad says there was too much cuddle going on there. <laughs> she doesn't, yeah, you know what she does to Mummy? Mummy will hold her, and when she goes to walk, she'll start licking Mummy's face right here. She'll lick her. Like, you don't do that to Daddy. No, you just try to scratch him and bite his shirt, like yank on his shirt with your teeth like this. Huh? I think her nails need trimmed. They're long. But anyways, Arcade Dad, you have to go do your Minecraft stream now. I hope everyone enjoyed this uh, enjoyed this stream tonight. We got back to playing the claw machine. I was really hoping to give away one of the big prizes, guys. Either like a plush or uh, something else. I was kind of hoping to give this away. This thing's been sitting here for months, I'll be honest. <laughs> Since the last time I tried to give it away. Remember when uh, Flame Dragon almost won it? If he would have picked the right paper, it would have been his. Um... But we tried, guys. We tried. But it's, it's still set up for next time. So we're going to leave it exactly how it is except for the claw machine. The coin pusher is going to stay exactly the same. The claw machine is going to change, guys. We'll, we'll change it to all dimes in there. So that way everyone that wins gets to play the coin pusher. How's that sound? But again, that means we're going to put some more prizes in the coin pusher that say shout out then. So... But, uh, yeah, guys, don't forget, too, if you want to watch this replay on, like, a desktop or a laptop computer uh, or even on your phone and then uh, get the Discord, the Discord is now public, guys. There's there's uh, public chats for everybody. Come in. Come hang out. Chat. We try to be as active as we can. Some days, unfortunately, we're just not active at all. But um, it just it depends on everyone's interaction. So we try to be active. You know, we, we have good conversations in there. It's a lot of fun. Uh, members still have their private channels in there, so that way they know when new videos come out. It's everything's, you know, uh, set aside for them. So members of the channel definitely get to uh, enjoy that perk. And I think that's the Nightbot command for it. I don't remember. But anyways. Yeah, there it is. And I guys, I don't have different tiers like other people do. Mine is one. It's five dollars a month. One tier gets you all the perks. Tell that to the other YouTube channels, huh? The ones that are charging twenty-five dollars to say, "Hey, I'm going to put your name in a video." Twenty-five dollars a month, and I'll put your name in a video. That's not cool. But um... <laughs> yeah, guys, I have one tier. That's all I have. If you see anything else on my channel, I didn't set it up. YouTube did. Um, mine is $5 a month, period. That's it. But, uh, the arcade dad says, wow, that makes me feel like a jerk for having tears. No, your tears are good. You actually have good tears. Other bigger YouTubers have, bigger arcade YouTubers have a $25 tier that says, get your name in a video. And that's it. You don't get anything else. Or no, you get like a postcard or something. One postcard sent to you. For $25 a month. Like, come on now. So anyways. 
Joe, what's the best thing to put into a pie? Your teeth. <laughs> That's pretty good. I like that. <clears throat> I want my name in a video. It says blank. It says blank. I don't even know your name. I'll be honest. What is it? A, comma, a couple commas? I mean... <laughs> Shout out to the mods who help with the chat stream. Thank you to all of you, says Nightbot. I forgot to put that command in there. $1,000 tier. Get my spit water sent to you, TM. <laughs> oh, Jay Debbie. No, that's my used bath water. You guys get my used bath water for $1,000 a month. Urgh. There's some girl on Instagram that sells that. Ew. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, it's like $200 for a, a jar of her bath, used bath water. I saw it on, uh, is it the no? No, Inside Gaming. Inside Gaming by um, uh, the guys at Rooster Teeth. I think it's uh, Funhouse. I think Funhouse does that. Fantastic Wit says, Michelle, that was legit, too. Yeah, it is legit. It, it is gross. And here's the thing. Oh, no, no. You know where I saw it? I saw it on Pat the NES Punk. I saw it on Pat the NES Punk, his uh, CU podcast. Um, he reported about it. It's like $200 for a jar of used bath water. You don't even know if it's used bath water. She could just take water from the freaking tap, you know, for a couple cents and, and put it in a jar and send it to you and say, oh, yeah, it was used. You could sell the girl's poops off for like 50 bucks. The girl's what? Poops. Poops? Yeah. Oh, the girl's poops. Oh, we can sell the guinea pig poop for 50 bucks, Michelle says. Yeah, exactly. Here, guys, let's get you some guinea pig poop. You can make decorations with it. <laughs> Cat Girl Christy says, I'm in the wrong business if that's selling. Okay, so here's the thing, guys. She has millions of followers on Instagram. So you figure if a few hundred people buy it out of those millions, you know, at a few hundred dollars a pop, you're looking at tens of thousands of dollars she's making. Oh, people actually buy it. Oh, yeah. There's weird people out there. What they do with it? Just look at it? I don't know. I don't want to know what they do with it. I, mean, like, there's no I don't want to know if they, like, taste it or... There's, like, no celebrity. I don't want to Amber Sweet says, I walked into the words guinea pig poop. <laughs> oh, Amber Sweet, you missed an awesome live stream. Luckily, it'll be up for replay. So if you guys are just are just joining... It will always, all these live streams will always be up for replay. So you guys can definitely, uh, they were drinking it? Ew. Oh, God. Oh. I think I need to end this live stream now. Okay, got to go start up my stuff. Have a good one, man. Yeah, Arcade Dad, I'm passing it over to you. Arcade Dad, go live. We're going to go raid you. Everyone that's here, guys, as soon as the Arcade Dad goes live, please jump onto his stream and say hi tell him i sent you and let's go raid his stream and give him a bunch of a uh, bunch of views right now give him a bunch of thumbs up too amber sweet says yeah i'm lame no it's okay i understand you're on the west coast you're three hours behind me it's only 7 30 for you she, in LA. she is is she in la i don't know she's in sacramento which is quite a few hours away from la i think it's four hours i think it's a four hour drive it's becoming Joe after dark. No, it's becoming Joe's going down the weird spiral. Um, oh, the Arcade Dad's live, guys. All right, everyone, jump over to the Arcade Dad. Give him a heck yeah, and then uh, and tell him I sent you. Give him a couple views. Watch him play some Minecraft, guys. He's awesome at it. He's got this really cool setup going on. Go check it out. Give him a heck, heck yeah. Give him a thumbs up. And thank you guys for watching. And as I always say... I'll catch you guys next time. Bye, guys.